Whoever was living here must have left. Too bad they didn't leave anything behind. Someone's still living here. Oh, I've seen this before. Don't move. I'm warning you. Oh, I'll... I'll gut you like a fucking fish. <laughs> you do look like a sad little fish, don't you? That happened a lot. I can fix it for you. But my friend is hurt. We're just looking for a place to rest. There are others with you. Garrett! Is that...? Just let us go. We'll leave. That's what you want, isn't it? Cotter! Oh, Sylvie. You're alive! I told you I'd come back. Who is this? He's a friend. You brought a crow here. I had to. Cut her! She's dangerous! No, she's not! You see... Ah... Uh, this... is my sister, Sylvie. She's the reason I brought you here. She can take us to the North Grove. Lord Roderick. Lady Alyssa. Gwyn? Roderick, may I have a word? Thank you for accepting my father's invitation. I wasn't certain you'd come. Be honest with me. Am I in danger here? My father honors guest right, just as you do. And I'm supposed to trust my life to that? I wanted us to work together, but you refused. So now my father is doing this his way. If you value your life and your family, you'll listen to what he has to say. You need to take him seriously today, which means keeping a level head. I'm here in good faith, aren't I? Yes, I suppose you are. There are lords who wield power. And lords who like to make a show of it. These walls hold a thousand years of White Hill history. A thousand years of bloodshed. But our houses were close once, and could be again. So much of our history has been lost. Shall we get on with it? The Great Hall is this way. Your soldiers seem on edge. Well, what do you expect? The way they see it, the enemy is within their walls. What's this? M my lady? Give us a moment. Is this your family? Shortly before Griff was born. Are these your brothers? The eldest three, yes. Carl died of grayscale a few years ago. Ebbets at the Citadel. Torin serves Roose Bolton. And Griff, of course, wasn't born yet. Your father doesn't smile much, does he? He used to, when my mother was still alive. The father isn't one for poor. That must be you. A <laughs> much younger me. Yes. You look a bit like your mother now. Mm. 
My brothers were never kind to Griff. He was boastful, gullible, and quick to anger. But my father always defended him. A white hill is a white hill, he'd say. Come on, we mustn't keep my father waiting. Where's your father? Strange. I'll go find him. I don't like this. Don't show fear. That's what he wants. Ryan for Griff. That's still our plan. I'll follow your lead, my lord. Let's have a look around, see what we find. Why all this, if they mean to betray us? Bread and salt would mean we're protected by guest right. He's testing us, seeing what we're made of. What's Lord Whitehill planning? Bloodshed, most likely. We won't go down without a fight. Just follow my lead, whatever happens. from the other side. Roderick! Welcome to High Point. Lord, my men say you've been acting a bit tense. You're not nervous, are you? I could ask you the same thing. All these soldiers... Sounds like you're feeling outnumbered. Father, please. Can we just get on with this? Well? Why? You know... Your father once called High Point a keep for the gods. What stonework, he said. What craftsmanship. He wouldn't stop talking about it. If you ask me, I'd say he was envious. High Point is very impressive. It is, compared to your pile of timber. Lord, where's Ryan? Always worried about your family, aren't you? Let's toast to family! Won't you toast with me, Roderick? To family. To, to fam family. family. Now, as lovely as this is, I presume we have business to discuss. Indeed we do. The Ironwood business is thriving, Roderick. In fact, the Boltons want weapons faster than we can make them. And when Roos Bolton wants something, I like to give it to him. So, in other words, you need our help. <laughs> Don't be so damn full of yourself. You foresters are headed for destruction. Yet, you know more about Ironwood than any house in the realm. Would be a shame for all that knowledge to be lost. 
Help me craft ironwood for the Boltons, and I'll make sure you foresters survive. As if he'd protect us. <laughs> if you think you can threaten I'm us. I'm not threatening. So you're proposing an alliance? An alliance? I said nothing of the sort. He'd make us his slaves. Roderick, this could save your house. I'd consider an alliance. You see what I have to put up with? Just give him time. I told you... I offer you peace, and you spit at it. I offer opportunity, and you demand more. I've seen this coming since you refused to kiss my ring. Here's how it's gonna go, Roderick. Either you agree to my terms, or I'll have Griff tear Ironrath to the ground. He'll put it to the torch! This isn't the way to They're get what you want! They're slaughtering your small folk! Maybe he'll even make you watch. Griff won't be doing a damn thing. What do you mean? He's locked in our darkest cellar along with your entire fucking garrison. You didn't. You've imprisoned my son. He was there by order of the Warden of the North! Roderick, how could you? You miscalculated, Lord. Now you'll pay the price. If you want Griff back, my brother returns home. We want Ryan back, and we want him today. Bring the boy! Ryan! Mother! Frotry! I... I thought you'd forgotten about... Uh, uh, no! Father, no! What are you doing? You imprisoned my flesh and blood. Mine! Let him go! He's not going anywhere! Listen to her! Don't I swear by this. the gods if you will... He's a child! Uh, a son for a son! This is not what we're... Blame doing. him! Not me. If you want to see Griff alive again... You think I give two shits about Griff? About my fucking fourthborn? Oh, I ought to kill you right now! Because you forest has never learned. I'm not afraid of you! Can I fucking murder him yet? Try it! Ryan, you so all let go of me! Let you go! Everyone, please! Fine, right. I'll take your Ironwood deal. If you make the trade... Come on, Lord. Things don't have to end this way. You're lucky I had no mercy. <coughs> Ryan, come here. No. We'll make the trade on neutral soil. Griff for Ryan. A son for a son. Fine. Now, get the fuck out of my hall. And the gods have mercy on us both when the Boltons come for their ironwood. Now go. It's been a pleasure, Lord. <laughs> I'm so sorry, Roderick. <laughs> There it is. The East Watcher. Now listen up. None of those guards can live long enough to light that beacon. Because if they do, this invasion gets a whole lot fucking harder. Don't drop that. We'll need to take those two out first. How many men do you think are in there? Hard to know for sure. At least five, maybe more. To answer your question, too many to fight head on. Is that a harpy? Of course it is. Those golden tits are everywhere in this bloody city. 
If those guards light the rope, the fire travels up to the bowl, and the whole city will know we're here. So we stop them. Aye. Come on, let's get moving. Beska. Hmm. It's nothing. Just forget it. Is it Dazor? He's dead. You gave him what he deserved. Time to move on. Not him I'm worried about. It's Croft. I hope he doesn't... Yeah, it's done now. I'll take him. I've got the other one. Just keep an eye on her. I don't need him to watch me. Then prove it! What have you heard? Just sit outside the gates waiting. Pfft. Mother of dragons. She wants to scare us. We'll split up. One group will go high and try to climb over to the other side. What about them? That's why someone needs to stay down here. They get behind cover and shoot the men up top. Just don't let that one see you. So, which will it be? We'll stay on the ground. You take the wall. I think he got the easy job. on the roof. We'll take care of it. I'll get rid of them. You will have 
We took on the Lost Legion by ourselves. This is nothing. Let's do this then. You ready? Now! Hey! Get it! <laughs> Light the beacon! Stop him! Did it. Croft! Croft! Quit your whippering. I'm not dead yet. Hear that? <sighs> it's starting. At High Point, I wasn't sure your brother would survive the day. He nearly didn't. But you kept your head and took Lud's deal. And now Ryan will be coming home. He'll sleep in his bed. Eat at our table. He'll be right here, where he belongs. It was worth it. Nothing's more important than family. <sighs> oh, Roderick. Sometimes you sound just like your father. My lord, look. Where are the gods?
Dahlia? Duncan? Where are the Glenmores? Where's anybody? <laughs> Wait here. <laughs> Come on. Don't be so dreary. It was a joke. I'm sorry, I... I should have laughed. Oh, maybe you think you can do better. Of course not. I... I didn't mean to... Perhaps a song instead. I hear you've written a touching song about your dead brother. Am I in it? Let's hear it, shall we? No. No? Roderick! Roderick! Welcome back. State your business now. I thought you'd have more courtesy. Especially after getting to know your sister. We've had a lovely time together. Haven't we, Talia? Say it. Say it's been lovely. It's been... lovely. And you? I'm told you're a man who can't be broken. I've decided to come see for myself. Ethan was the first forester I killed. Doesn't have to be the last. You don't know what you're in for, Garrod. What you're asking my brother to do. The North Grove isn't what you think it is. Justice was for Marine to deliver, not you. But we did as you commanded! These aren't cell swords, Asher. They're killers. Roderick! I can't believe I trusted him. I know you and my brother were in contact. Perhaps he told you things. Things that might prove his guilt. Perhaps you're not to be trusted either. Oh, you're not listening, Garrett. Shh. 